Mike McCool here in the Royal Examiner studio, and with me today, I have folks from the library. How's that? <laughs> That's good. I have Melody Hotek, um, Chris Estes, Aaron Rooney, all great people there. Uh, Aaron is our new librarian. He started this year. Mm -hmm. We every time the library ladies come in, we talk about the bad romance because I know that's your, <laughs> one of Chris, our book clubs. I know, Chris Estes, you're on the Friends of the Samuels Library. I'm you're president the president of the Friends of Samuels Library. That's yes. a lot of work to do, I can tell you. And Melanie Hotek, you are the trustee, and you're also uh, something else. What is it? So I'm the president of the Friends of okay. the not the Friends of the Library Library Board. That's yeah. right. I knew you were yeah. on there somewhere because you're yeah. great. So a lot of things have happened here over the summer. Yeah. Tell us what happened. I We couldn't be more excited. So the announcement came through um, that we were awarded Trustee of the Year, Friends Group of the Year, and Samuel Scott Library of the Year. <laughs> so so it's in the kind of, oh, I just got goosebumps. <laughs> you, know, yeah, yeah. Uh, you, you know, it's it's it, when other people outside the, completely outside the organization can recognize the great things you do, yeah. it does make you feel good, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So the process is uh, community nominated, and then it goes to the Virginia Library Association, mm -hmm. and their committee um, decides on out of four, out of all the nominations and almost 400, libraries right. in the state of Virginia and the community can be very pleased. I mean, it was community activated sure. and supported. And so I, I'm hopeful that the community just embraces these awards and takes it on and can be extra proud of a library they've already shown that they're right, proud right. of. You know, when you go up against all your, the neighborhood, so to speak, but yeah. you've gone up and tired every library in the state. And exactly. you know there's a lot of good libraries. There are a lot of good so, libraries. And, and a lot that have a whole lot more money than you do. <laughs> yeah, that's a fact. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We're, we're a small community. Yeah, and small And you're county. up against libraries in big cities and yeah. big counties. Yeah. So that really says something about the things that the library is doing, and it really should... Uh, you know, make our community proud that we have so we always say it's a great library, but yeah. when it's when other people say it, it's, yeah. it's even better. Yeah. So what are we gonna do? How are you gonna top it next year? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think we'll just ride that wave for a little while. Yeah. yeah. Well, how about the friends group? How do they decide what does the friends group do? Why don't you tell us that? Well in in short, the friends group is an an independent nonprofit whose mission is to support the library. We're separate, but we exist for the library. Um, but what we do is we raise money and we volunteer in various ways, to, you know, to do things. We we have members whose fees and donations, mm -hmm. you know, of course, are our lifeblood. Um, we have volunteers who run our book sale, um, which I'd love to talk to you about. Which is coming up yes. real soon. Yeah. Um, and who work in our bookstore every day. Uh, and we have a board of directors, and, and they decide how Fossil is going to support the library and where Fossil is going. Right. Friends of Samuel's Library. That's a great thing to do. Yeah. Are, are they involved with like your other volunteers that you have working there, or is that kind of separate of friends? You want to talk about the volunteers? Yeah, we have an amazing volunteer pool. I mean, there's so much stuff we wouldn't be able to do without them. Uh, we are. That's one of the great things about our communities. We have so many people willing to come in and volunteer. Right. Um, there's a little bit of overlap. We have a lot of friends members that also volunteer in other parts of the libraries and vice versa. So we're um, we're just we're lucky to have them. They've been absolutely amazing. Yeah, yeah it's amazing. You got a lot of people that, and, and some of them just volunteer a small amount of time. Yeah. Others volunteer quite mm -hmm. a bit. So yeah. and then next week they don't volunteer at all. So you're open. To to, yeah, uh, you know, to a lot of just come where as you are, yeah, right? Yeah. Exactly. We have a wide range of different volunteer opportunities for things like coming in to help us get books ready to go on the shelf or programming opportunities. We even have a uh, teen volunteer program as well that we have um, a lot of uh, teens coming in to, to get experience. And My granddaughter Lucy volunteers yes. yeah. every yeah. Thursday. It's a great program. <laughs> well, I know that it looks good on their resume. Yeah. And I don't, you don't, and then yeah. it also makes them feel good too. Yeah. And there's a lot, a lot of, uh, you know. They grow up fast when they start to work. Yes. And, and, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's great. It's great. So what about the library now? I mean, they've selected you from all over the state. I just hard to believe. I mean, I always, I just, can you imagine it? Can you even imagine? Because you've been in some great libraries in, in the state. I, I have, and they're absolutely amazing. I, I'll just say that, you know, we have uh, a wonderful team that they've, they just, they do so much. Uh, and we have an absolutely fantastic community that we're uh, so just 
blessed that we're able to to serve. And yeah, when we got that that notice that we we won, we just kind of all just like jumped for joy oh, and did a happy dance. dance. <laughs> you, 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 know, you thought, well, you like placed pretty good, right? Yeah. Uh, and I know why you won, Samicon. <laughs> <laughs> it, is, it is coming up this Saturday. You, know, you don't, don't want the list. You don't want the I, Samicon <laughs> Technology <laughs> Mellon Foundation. Yeah. You don't want the list. We will be here all day. I know it's a lot of lot of things, but it, it's all those little things yeah. combined together. It is that brings the community together, and you're I think right, that's Mike. what it's about. Yeah, yeah. you're right. We, we try and do it. as much as yeah. we can with what we have, and we just it, and it's one of the great things about I, I love about the profession is we're able to uh, think up new ideas and, and different ways to yeah. bring programming services to to the community. You yeah. try it, and if it don't work, we'll try something else. Exactly. Yeah. exactly. You know, I always, Aaron told me, she says she's done so much for so long, for so little, she can do anything with nothing. <laughs> you like that? I'm giving you that quote. I yeah. love it. <laughs> well, it's Remember so great. But like, Samicon is coming up soon. Mm -hmm. Let's talk what's coming up, uh, like, next week, uh, the Fossil book sale. The book sale happens from September 26th to September 30th. September 26th is a members-only night, but you can you can join right at the door, and it's not expensive. <laughs> we're we're going to have thousands and thousands of books. Yeah, and these yeah. books come from where? These books come from donations. Some of them are, are from from you know weeding off the library shelves, mm -hmm. uh, but a lot of them could just come. People come in, they donate their books to the library, and the library has a process to determine where right. they go. Yeah. They go to the shelves. <laughs> we have seven copies of this one. We don't quite need yeah, seven, exactly. right? Yeah. Yeah. It's another example of community support. So yeah. they're all donated by a wonderful community that loves to read, and we get books and we process them and save them up for the sale. Or yeah, how about my Encyclopedia Britannica? What can I do with those? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> There's probably a, probably a taker for it. You know, you know, it's, it's, you, know you say that now because yeah. it's the internet and there's so much of that stuff. Yeah. But I can remember my kids were little; they read those things cover to cover. Yeah, mm -hmm. it's just yeah. like now it's like. You know, yeah. web surfing. You know, you right. surf through the, right. through the through the you know, encyclopedia. It was great. Mm -hmm. So, what's on the next horizon? Have we got anything planned? Uh, how did you motivate? Was your staff happy? Oh, you know, uh, absolutely! Yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely amazing. Yeah. Um, yeah, we're we're super excited, and uh, like so, one of the big things we have coming up, of course, is Sammy Con. Right. Um, this and, weekend. Yeah, this weekend, uh, and that'll be from ten to four thirty. And actually, one of the cool things we're doing is uh, uh, twice during that day, we'll actually have walk-ins for the new Studio Three Thirty uh, Memory Lab Makerspace. Yes. yes. So it, it won't be officially open to the public yet, but you'll be able to walk through and see some of the different equipments that we have, and and talk about the different programs. So we're I've very to, I've been sending people to you because they say, yeah. can you come in and transfer this VHS? I said, no, you need to go to the library. Oh, what? We, we the can library? Do it. We can I said, yes, do the it. library, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah we, we've added so many things. Um, VHSC is one of the, the formats that I'm, I'm myself, I, I brought in a couple that I found in my closet at home that I'm looking forward to, uh, to testing it out and, and seeing what I can I'm find. I'm going to donate some of my adapters. You need some of those adapters. Oh, we, uh, anything like that, we would be more than willing to yeah. take, yeah. 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 Did you ever get that 8mm working yet? <laughs> we're, we're working on it. <laughs> That w well, and that was one of the, the formats I was very surprised with that there was um, the, the most uh, drawn demand for. Right, right. Um, yeah, all the old Super 8, 8 millimeter film yeah, reels yeah. from, you know, back in the day. So, yeah, and they're, yeah. they're exciting to watch. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Today, we're getting a delivery. Uh, yes, we, just just this morning, uh, we have our new sound booth that's just been delivered. Okay. Um, so, you if you come into the library after today, you'll see it in uh, the back of the uh, adult section of the library. Um, it won't be up open to the public until we get all the all the things worked out. Um, but it'll be it'll give people the opportunity to come in, and if they have any audio or uh, video recording that they need done, they can reserve that space to come in and do it. We'll have uh, microphones that you can check out to use in there. Uh, we'll also be able available with our new studio to help yeah. uh, with uh, video editing and teaching how to do that, that type yeah. of stuff. So put me out of business. No, no. <laughs> No, to, no. Now this this is just the basics. Just I mean, the basics. like you, you couldn't come in and do like um, audio, uh, like a uh, music recording, unfortunately, anything like that. Yeah. But if you want to learn, but how you to can bring your grandma or, in and get her to talk or in her own voice. That's something and get very important. Yeah. I encourage people yeah. to do that because you know yeah. we'll all be gone sooner than we realize. Yeah. yeah and, I regret not having my parents' voices yeah. on on yeah. digital yeah. For, in a digital format. Yeah. You know. Well, we talked what you know, we talked about fossil in the library, but let's go back to the trustee for a minute okay. cuz the trustee is kind of like the heart of the whole, like you have the ultimate responsibility, don't you? Our board does. Yes, I mean I'm the just, trustees uh, in general. Trustees I mean, in general. I'm I'm the I am the honor of being the lead, but we have a magnificent board that yeah. um, just fills all kinds of uh, skill sets and um, 
Yeah. It's, and it's quite extensive. I mean, you have a pretty good size it's trustee 15. board. 15. Yeah. Yeah, 15. And Cheryl Colors is our uh, supervisor representative. Right. And it's we get a lot done in committees and then the board meetings and they're they're just a wonderful board yeah, i can't yeah. say enough about them yeah so i'm honored it takes a i hate to say it takes a village you know but it does it does it does it, take it does. A, a lot of people coming together yeah and, and making making that happen yeah. making the you yeah know. keeping everything on track it's a governance board and yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, so. people don't realize more than just more than just books. Where have you heard yes. that? Yeah. Yeah. Is, we, yeah. we are books, but we are more than just books. Yeah, because books. it takes a lot, yeah. uh, you know, to, to make the you know to open the door every morning. And right. I think people, right. I think our community appreciates you. Yeah. So I want to congratulate you again you. and uh, invite everyone to come to SammyCon this weekend. SammyCon, September's busy. SammyCon, and then the book sale. Right. And then good things then <coughs> then we'll have uh the opening of the studio 330 yeah so a lot happening in the next 330 three, what's weeks. that supposed to represent? so that's actually our street number oh i was gonna say because normally <laughs> you use 360 because it's round yeah you know? no we we're our address is 330 east chrysler oh so, so. studio i knew it, I knew it had been <laughs> it's clever clever you yeah. are so clever Aaron. <laughs> all right again thanks so much well, for all the you. great things thank you do you, for Mike. our community and uh, and, and our you know, thanks to the community. We're yes. just very grateful. 100%. Yes. yes. Appreciate it. Thanks again. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you.